One thing I like about this adult collector doll is she's so adulty and for adult collectors only, not for kids, which is exactly like my channel. Um, it is for adult collectors only looking to purchase gifts or for themselves. And I unbox that for them and then they decide if it's something that they're interested in because that's what adults do, so. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I found my doll opening scissors. They were right on top of a box I haven't unboxed yet. So yeah, today we are opening up the Modern Circle Barbie doll. Um, she is an indie film producer looking to cast her leading man. Um, and she is from 2003. And I mean, that was like 17 years ago. Can you believe that? That's crazy. Um, but I got her because she has like that kind of like silk stone, um, older looking face and the crazy red hair with the straight bangs. I love straight bang Barbies. I think they're adorable. There's a Ken doll in this line I want to get too. And I just think like these dolls are awesome. They have like this mid-century kind of look in architectural theme to them. And even the box is like in a weird like triangle shape angle. And I love that. And it looks like Barbie, because this is the Barbie from it. Like she's not blonde in this. Um, Barbie volunteers on weekends as a museum docent and enjoys Sunday reading with the morning paper with her cat on her lap. So she's like a smart, independent um, business lady. And she comes with cute little accessories and everything. But I've had this like just sitting, waiting to be unboxed for like over a year now. Um, Cause I always had like the idea of doing a YouTube channel in my like head. And I didn't know if it was gonna be dolls or makeup. And now I just do both because I can do whatever I want. But yeah, she's super cute. So we're gonna get her out of the box and I just kinda wanna show you like the back of the box, the artwork on it. Um, it's just a cute little design. The doll on the, like the way they drew her on the back, I think she looks so, um, it's just not flattering. Like I'm glad that the, the doll came out better than like the concept art, that's for sure. But yeah, let's get her out of the box guys and we'll get a closer look. Okay guys, and here is Modern Circle Barbie out of the box. She has very, very soft orange hair. I love that. Um, she doesn't have rooted eyelashes, but they are molded eyelashes, so they pop out and everything like on the older faced Barbies. She does have articulation, but it's like weird articulation I've never like really seen before on a Barbie because she is from 2003, which <clears throat> if you want to know how long ago that was, on this laptop, she has yahoo.com up. Like, that's how long ago this was. It was like when Yahoo was relevant. And yeah, it's like a little website on her laptop. And the cool thing is, the side of the laptop, there's like a way to take the card out that's in here and you can change up the website if you wanted. Um, and then she also has like a cute little pleather bag and everything with a sewn on zipper, but still like it's more detailed than what we've been getting lately. Um, and she does come with one of the old like full stands. There's not, it's not like hollow underneath or anything, but yeah, um, her outfit's super cute. Um, and from what I can tell, there's no Velcro. It's just like metal snaps. And then there's like beadwork and everything on here, but we are going to take off her clothes so we can get um, a better look at her articulation and everything but the material on the coat's nice. She's holding like a little PDA weird kind of cell phone, which I know at the time was like super like modern and relevant, but now it just looks like crazy. Um, and she's wearing like black high heel pumps and they kind of look like the standard like silk stone pumps with like the little buckle and everything. But yeah, why don't we get her undressed so we can see her articulation. <clears throat> So this doll keeps reminding me how long ago 2003 actually was because like the rubber bands on this are already yellowing and the plastic on the stand is already yellowing. I cannot believe that. 
Um, yeah, this is like some crazy articulation. Also, her hair is shedding. It's like, it's getting everywhere. Um, but this is some crazy articulation on a Barbie. I haven't seen this before. So her head does go from side to side and then up and down. Love that. And then she does have articulation in the shoulders and she can rotate the shoulder or go up and down. She has articulation at the elbow, but it's that weird like Mycene articulation, which makes sense because it was around like the same time. So it's just in the elbow, but it, the elbow can rotate and then go up and down. There's no articulation in the wrist, but she does have a little hole in her fingers so that she can hold that weird PDA foam. Um, and then her waist is like the weirdest one. It's like on a ball or something so that it can like rotate back and forth like that. Tiny, tiny waist. And then her legs are the ones that are like held together with like a stretchy bungee cord. So you can like straight up just pop out her leg like that but it gives her good articulation. She has articulation in the knees and then none in the ankles, but that's totally fine. And then she has like molded on panties and everything. Um, and her eyes are like crazy green. I love that. But yeah, she's super cute. Um, the legs are like barely like held together though. Like I can just pull that out, like no problem. So she's definitely going to be like a display doll, which is great because she does come with a stand and a certificate of authenticity. Um, but yeah, we'll get you, I'm going to get her dressed and then we'll give you guys a closer look again. Here she is up and close. You can see her cute little like silk stone looking retro face. Love the hair color, the eye color, even though the hair shedding, I can like, you know, fix that. Her clothes were kind of like attached together with that little thread you can see on her shirt. Um, she's wearing a choker, very long like matrix kind of trench coat. And then she does have beadwork and everything and they just, they did details. Like look at that, like the coat can actually be shut or like closed together. And she just, she's so adorable. They did a really good job with this line and they use like good materials. So she's like, she's staying together. The articulation on it's crazy. I don't understand it, but it's fine. And then here is her little bag, her weird little PDA cell phone thingy. Like, let me show you, this is nuts. And it just says, hello. And yeah, it's just a crazy little phone. And then there is her laptop on yahooentertainment.com and it says like headline and everything. But yeah, she's just, she's just crazy. So this is the Modern Circle Barbie. She is an adult collector doll and she is super cute and I'm glad she's in my collection. Let me know if you have any of the Modern Circle dolls because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get Ken next. Um, he's awesome. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.